Hello, and welcome to another episode of Moose's Gear Goo Review. And this is... Oh, I'm Moose. <laughs> and today we're doing, because it's the end of 2018, we're doing my most used knife of 2018. So, this is different than my most carried knife because it doesn't always correlate uh, but it's the knife that I actually end up using the most. I might not carry it every day, but it's the one that I have sitting out and lying around. And for whatever reason, it's always in the right place at the right time for me to use. And so, so yeah. So last year, this is my most carried knife was the Spyderco Cat, which I love. But this was my most used knife. I just ended up using this more often than my cat because I had it around when I needed a knife and that wasn't necessarily on me but it was on the counter or whatever so that's how that happened and once again it's in the lineup it's in the running for most used knife of 2018 uh so that being said these are my knives i have the uh benchmade 556 uh the cpm 20 cv uh, blade steel G10 handle scales. I got the Spyderco Little Native compression lock and S30V. I got the Benchmade Bugout and S30V. I have the Kershaw Pub and 8CR13 and the uh, Kershaw Skyline in 14C28N. So, out of these knives, I have to say, uh, though I really started off the year heavily carrying this a lot and using it. Um, in the end, I did not uh, use it to the full max, partially because I lost it for a short period of time. Um, but, you know, I ended up using other knives, partially because they just had a longer uh, blade length. So, there's that. Uh, out of these ones, I ended up pulling away from the Skyline. Still love this thing. I still would use it all the time if it was around. Um, but this year, I just didn't use it as much as I did last, so it's not in the top three. That being said, uh, when it comes to actually using the knife as a knife, I had to factor that in as my most used knife. Now, the Kershaw Pub is a multi-tool. I mean, it, the primary function is a friction folding knife, but it does have a cap lifter and a flathead. And because that is the case... I realized that I actually used sometimes the other tools on it more than I actually did the cutting edge. So for that, I have to factor that in, and I didn't end up uh, using it, even though it was my most carried knife of 2018. So it came in third place. Uh, so that being said, I have two Benchmades. Benchmades beat out all the other knives. Um... I will say, when it comes to just having a knife laying around that's easy to grab, um, and I carry it a decent amount of time, the bug out uh, is just awesome. Great for just slicing open food packages and cutting open your mail or whatnot. Um, same with the mini grip. And honestly, these knives are very similar in size. Looks like the bug out is slightly larger. Um, but when it came down to it, which knife I actually ended up using the most in 2018, I would take this hiking a little bit more just because it's designed more for kind of like backpacking, being so lightweight and, and having that extra large lanyard hole and whatnot. Um, I did take this one out downtown from time to time, a little bit smaller, deep carry, whatever. Uh, but when it came to hard use or just using it the most... The Benchmade Mini Grip Tillion and CPM 20 CV actually was my most used knife of the year this year. Uh, which surprised me because, you know, I, I love the materials. I don't necessarily love the gray. Um, so, But I ended up carrying this to work, uh, specifically at the butcher shop, uh, so many times. And it just held up. And then besides that, just having it around the house, uh, opening up. Uh, packages that I got in the mail, opening up food packages, um, cutting cord, or just carrying around me 
uh, when I was, you know, working on things or trying to set things up or cleaning, it just came in so handy for breaking down boxes and whatnot. It's just a great all around utility knife that you will get a ton of use out of. And that is why it is my most used knife of 2018. And as you can see, I got some decent wear on the pocket clip. Um, the blade just stays sharp forever. And I just strop it and it kind of hones itself back up after a couple minutes. And it's just awesome. So there you have it, guys. That is the Mini Grip CPM 20 CV uh, Super Steel version. Highly recommend this. You will get a ton of use out of it. And you can't, uh, you can't not get a ton of use out of any of these blades. This one. Like I said, as a multi-tool, I use that flathead all the time. So, super good. Super, super, super good. Uh, remember, I'll leave links in the description below um, to these some of these knives if I can. Definitely the mini grip. Uh, so, you can check those out. Check the prices on them as well. Uh, check out these other videos over here. Click that subscription button. Hit that bell notification button. Uh, check that in the upper right-hand corner. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you outside, guys. Happy New Year. Take care.